Hi, in this video I'm going to introduce you to a text by Comenius, the Januae Latinitatis Vestibulum. It's a very small text, it's just contained in these few pages, and it um, is intended for the very first lessons in Latin. Comenius assumed it would take about nine months to teach this text, giving his six-year-old students a vocabulary of around 2,000 words, most of them key words in the Latin language. You can find this text on DVD in audio at latinum.org.uk. I'll repeat that, latinum.org.uk. And on the DVD, I read the text in Latin, English, Latin. And then again, I read the text in Latin only. And also on the DVD, you will find the PDF file of um, the um, text that I'm actually reading from. So let's start. I'll give you an idea of what's in this text. It starts at um, Januae Latinitatis Vestibulum, the uh, door or the, the entrance hallway to the gate of, of languages, or the portal, or the, the porch, I suppose. Um, venite puri. Come, children. Discite latinam linguam. Learn the Latin language. Pulcram et elegantem. It is beautiful and elegant. Comprehendite. Understand it. Pro vestro captu. According to your ability. Et varias res. And those diverse things, sapientiae semina, the seeds of wisdom. Deus vos juabit, God will help you. Praeceptores amabunt, the teachers will love you. Ali laudabunt, others will praise you. Ipsi gaudebitis, you yourselves will rejoice. Si principium difficile, if the beginning be hard. Medium erit facile, the middle will be easy. Finis jucundus, the end will be pleasant. And then he goes through a chapter called Accidentibus Rerum, uh, the accidents of things, that's the properties of things. For example, he says here, um, Locus est magnus aut parvus, a place is big or little. Tempus longum aut breve, time is long or short. And what he always does here is he contrasts things. So he puts opposites so that you're learning useful um, vocabulary for, for speaking Latin. Aria lata, well angusta, a courtyard is broad or narrow. Domus ampla, well arcta, a house is large or cramped. Montes sunt alti, mountains are tall, and so on he goes on and on and on. Colores, he talks about colors. Creta est alba, chalk is white, so always applying things to objects. Comenius was a great believer that all of the senses should be involved in learning. He um, wrote an introduction to this text. He said that the teachers should go out and get a big box and fill it up with models of all of these things, and where models are not possible, he said the walls of a classroom should be plastered in pictures, so that the students are not just reading words, they also have the images, and where possible they can also touch the things and play with them. Um, so he's always tying things into the real world, where possible. Um, Sapores, savers, mel es dulce, honey is sweet, and then he's got a very nice description of this acrid. Acrid is quite hard to describe. So he goes, Immaturam pomum acerbum. Well, austerum. An unripe apple is, is um, sour, acerbum. Well, austerum. Oh, it's, it's, it's acrid. Um, it's hard for us to, that, that, that's acerbic, we would say, um, in English. Odores, smells. Um, Feator tether, a stink is disgusting. Um, aliae qualitates, other qualities, and he talks about clay and dust and bones and flesh and ice and things like that. Um, different types of, of character traits. Um, 
unicornis est ferrum animal. A unicorn is a fierce animal. Um, waka, mansuetum, a cow is gentle or tame. Leo saivum, a lion is cruel. And ois, mite, a sheep is quiet. Um, okay. And then he goes about more different types of things. Sermo jocosus, where serious, a speech is merry or serious. Historia certa, how dubious, a history is certain or it is doubtful. Testimonium verum, at falsum, a testimony is true or false. He introduces the comparatives. Um, primus is doctus, the first person is doctus, educated. Secundus doctior, the next level up, more educated. Tertius doctissimus, and the third level up, the most educated. Um, he lists the an anomala comparatio, the irregular um, comparisons, um, always tying it in to reality. Taurus est magnus, a bull is big. Camelus maior, but a camel is bigger. Elephas maximus est, an elephant is the biggest. Um, and he goes through different birds going in other directions, small and smaller and smallest. Um, he goes good, better, best with various things. He talks about beer and med and wine. Um, chapter 2 deals with the rerum actionibus et passionibus, the actions and passions, that's the emotions of things. Um, Stellae micant, the stars twinkle. Mane, incipides, day begins in the morning. Vesperi, nox, and night is the evening. Um, Elementorum, the different elements. So, flamma flagrat, the flame flashes. Scintilla gliscit, a spark glows. Tonitru tonat, thunder thunders. Ventus flat, wind blows. And he goes through all the, the forces of nature. Um, for example, flores floret, a flower flowers, uh, etc. Um, animalium, very brief introduction to basic animals. Um, Arbor stat, a tree stands. Animal se moet, a living creature moves itself. Avis volat, a bird flies. Piscis natat, a fish swims. Quadrupes graditur, a four footed creature goes. Serpens serpit, a serpent creeps. Wormis repit, a worm crawls, and so on and so on. Animal noises. Um, Bos mugit, agnus balat, an ox lows, a lamb bleats, and so on. And he goes through these different bits and pieces. Um, hominis about man, very brief introduction to the parts of man, the heart, the lungs, the liver, the beard, all the different parts that you need to know to talk about um, basic sort of biology for everyday life. Um, mentis of the mind, mens cogitat, semper aliquid, the mind is always thinking about something. Talks about dreams, memory, um, character traits, and so on. Um, and then the last part, chapter 3, um, the rerum circumstantis, adverbia, so the circumstances of things and adverbs. He goes through some little introductory, very, very basic um, Interactions. So, quis vocat me? Who's calling me? Ego. I'm calling you. Tunes. Is it you? Quis est igitur illic? Who is there then? Paulus. Paul. Um, expectemus donec veniat. Let us wait until he comes. Bene. Good. Salve. Hello. Ago gratias. Thank you. Utvalias. How do you do? Seek mediocriter, so and so. Ubi fuisti, where have you been? Unde redis, where have you come from? Ex oppido, I've come from town. And so on and so on. Very, very basic conversational stuff. Um, that's um, prepositiones, prepositions. Also um, done in a sort of a conversational way. Mm. 
Pergamus, Robote, let us go in, I beg you. Nunc tibi parvas vocalas exponam. Now I'm going to explain the small words to you. Ad nos, trahimus, we draw to us, that's ad nos, trahimus, a nobis, um, trudimus, from us we push, right? cum nobis ducimus, with us we lead, ante nos pelimus, in front of us we drive, and pone nos raptamus, and we snatch from behind us. So he's introducing pone, ante, a, ad, cum. Secundum flumen facles natare, it's its womb with the stream, ad versus illud impossibile, against the stream, impossible. And so on. Uh, chapter, chapter 4 deals with uh, the rebus in scola, things in school, which of course is rather important because this is a school text, the teacher is going to be speaking Latin, and so the students have to know how things are dealt with in Latin. Um, scholasticus frequentat scholam, a scholar frequents school. Quo in artibus erudiatur, that he may be instructed in the arts. Initium est a literis, the beginning is from the letters. E syllabis voces componuntur, then you taught that words are composed of syllables, so the student then learns his syllables. E dictionibus sermo, a speech is made out of words. Ex libro legimus tacite, we read quietly from a book. Aut recitamus clare, or we read aloud from it. Um, and so on and so on. Different people in the school. Um, <coughs> non verberant baculo, we do not beat with a stick. Said caedunt vergis, but we chastise with birch rods. Ouch. Hmm. Um, absque venia ne exias, do not leave the room without permission. Post moram redias, um, after a delay, uh, come back. Quad agere debes age, what you have to do, do. It's the sort of thing a teacher would say. Um, linea, fit regula, a line is made with a ruler. Circulus circino, a circle is made with a set of compasses, and so on. And then the rebus domi, all the things you might find at home. Um, the door, the then, the then, what you carry with, all these various things. And then the, the uh, chapter 6, the rebus in urbe et regione, a brief description of uh, the city and the countryside. And chapter 7, uh, de virtutibus, about um, the virtues, um, philosophy, etc., but very, very briefly outlined. Um, sobrius non est ebrius, a sober person is not drunk, etc. Um, ye unare aliquando expedit, sometimes it's expedient to fast. Um, Onibus esto comis, be gentle to all, nemini blandus, flattering to no one. Adulator est odiosus, a flatterer is odious. Licet interdum jocari, it's permissible sometimes to make jokes, said urbane, but civilly. Ridere etiam licet, it's also allowed to laugh, said non cacinari, but not to giggle. Um, and so on and so on. Um, lots of advice. And then conclusio, um, the conclusion, multane supersunt, do many things remain? Pauca, puto, few, I think. Eke ultimus titulus, behold the last title, that's the last title, which is the conclusio. Nam hoc vestibulum est tantum exordium, for this portal is only a beginning. Quod non prolixum esse cominit. It is not suitable or fitting to be prolix, to be um, full of words, to be large. Venimus ergo ad clausulam, so we are come to the end. Vita transit, willet umbra, life passes like a shadow. Quick quid natum est, whatever is born, moritur it dies. Omnia sunt vana, everything is vain. O peccator, o sinner, 
Morste de Warabit. Death will consume you. Tanden ibis in sepulchrum, and then we go into the grave. E luke in tenebras, from the light into the shadows. Tu prinde quis quis es, and you therefore, whoever you are, um, formida infernum, fear hell. Desidera caelum, desire heaven. Pecare noli, do not sin, ne pereas, lest you perish. Um, lovely ending. So, acquiesce lector, reader rest contented. Um, reliqua reperies ordine, everything else you will find arranged, januam ingressus, ora ita. Entering the gate, pray thus. Mis serre nostri, have mercy on us, etc., etc. Das gat scientiam, give knowledge, da pietatem, give godliness, da beatitudinem, give blessedness, etc. Despite um, Comenius being a very religious man, and his um, whole program was to promote religion, there's actually very little religion in his texts. You find it in the first chapter, usually, um, and in the last chapter, um, but the rest of the stuff is actually pretty much completely secular. So if uh, you don't like that kind of thing, just avoid the very last chapter and the very first chapter of um, either the vestibulum, the vestibulum, or the Orbe Sensualium Pictus, the same thing again. Just the very, very first chapter has got stuff about um, um, religion. The last part of the vestibulum talks about the different religions in the world, but from a very academic perspective. Um, and the same structure is found in the Yanua itself. Uh, remember, latinum.org.uk, you can find this entire text. Um, I've really gone through it very rapidly here, just to give you an outline of what's in it. Um, on the DVD, read out in audio in um, Latin, English Latin, so that you can learn it. You will also find a PDF of the text there. This text is not available um, on Google Books as of 2011. It is available on Europeana, but only in a Latin Hungarian form. So if you speak Hungarian, you're in luck. Uh, maybe uh, sort of a Renaissance Hungarian anyway. And uh, there you have it. So latinum.org.uk for all of my Latin audio on DVD. This used to be on the Latinum podcast, but unfortunately the recession has led to um, mypodcast.com going belly up. Um, so Latinum as a podcast no longer exists, but the material is all available on latinum.org.uk. And you can find the complete Adler course there with hundreds and hundreds of hours of tuition for very low cost. Wale, goodbye.